What does the halacha says when a woman has a doubt about her ancestors or both lines? Uh, somebody, whether it's a man or a woman, a man or a woman is not sure about whether they're Jewish or not, they have to go through a conversion. It's called giyu, uh, um, uh, giyu safik, which is the, a, a conversion in order to eliminate the safik, in order to eliminate the doubt, it's, which means that if you really are Jewish, then that conversion is means nothing. It means nothing. You just fulfilled the obligation uh, of, of eliminating the doubt, and no one should doubt you anymore as far as to marry you or to, uh, uh, you know, uh, any type of Jewish ceremony, uh, even inviting you for Pesach. You know, like, you know, for example, we're not allowed to invite non-Jews to our Passover uh, Seder. Uh, so uh, you could invite a non-Jew... Uh, if you're going to teach him something uh, during the rest of the year, but uh, Pesach is not a time to uh, invite non-Jews. So if somebody's not inviting you to their house because they're not sure if you're Jewish, once you go through this process, you have no problem. If somebody's not marrying you because they're not sure if you're Jewish, now they don't have a problem, now they can marry you. So in regards to um, eliminating the doubt, if you really were Jewish, then you fulfill the obligation of eliminating the doubt, and which uh, means that you are fulfilling the mitzvah to be clean in the eyes of Hashem and men. If, on the other hand, you weren't Jewish, now you are. So now that you are Jewish, uh, you could uh, continue uh, uh, living that Jewish life. But it's important for a person to not live uh, in doubt.